The first step of grieving is anger. And one has to pay attention to that anger and give it its proper due if you're going to go deeper into the level of sorrow and ultimately into breaking through and letting go of the grief. Julia, Julia Butterfly is a prophet who, as you may know, sat in a tree in Northern California for two years to prevent the foresters from tearing it down, a big ancient uh, redwood tree. And she says when she was there, um, she was aware that there was anger and hate that could overwhelm her, as well as the fear and the sadness and frustration. So she was dealing with grief. I knew that to hate and strike out was to be a part of the same violence I was trying to stop, she said. She said, you see this in a lot of activists. The intense negative forces are oppressing and destroying the earth they wind up overtaking many of the activists. They get absorbed by the hate and the anger and become hollow. I knew I didn't want to go there. Instead, my hate had to turn to love, unconditional agape love. One day through my prayers, an overwhelming amount of love started flowing into me, filling up the dark hole that threatened to consume me. I suddenly realized that what I was feeling was the love of the earth, 